Hello, welcome back. Before we get into today's review, don't forget, all you lot that join us on the live streams, there is no live stream tomorrow because we're going up to Bonnie, Scotland. Next Saturday, there may be a live stream. Uh, we're coming back Saturday, but it depends what time we get back. So there may be one next Saturday to catch up with what's happened. And there is going to be some shorts videos, hopefully. Fingers crossed, if I get a decent connection, I'm going to upload some shorts of what we're doing, uh, where we've been and what the dogs have been up to. Ooh. So make sure you've got notifications turned on. Click the little bell icon next to the subscribe button and then you'll get a drop down menu. Click all so you get all notifications from us. We don't put loads out so you're not going to get inundated and it means you won't miss anything. If you just found us, by the way, subscribe. It's free, you know that. And to get everything out of the way, click the like button as well while you're at it. Do it now, below this video, the little thumbs up, click that, helps the channel out and it shows us that you like what you're watching. And don't forget, you can be a member now, yes. Exclusive perks including money off Spice and Easy Spice Packs. Ooh, right, let's get on with today's review. And it's that, yes, it's a new, new and also limited edition from Tilda. Now, you know I don't like ding rice microwave rice it's a ding rice i heard i'm not keen on it it's always a bit rubbery or i don't know but looking at the bottom they've got some spices in that in there and it's uh, a limited edition tilda sagaloo recipe or sagaloo it depends how posh you are sag well it's just when you get old everything sags uh sagaloo and it's uh, gluten free Ready in two minutes, it says, spinach, potato and warm Indian spices marry perfectly with our signature pure basmati rice. Great on its own or with a curry. Well, I ain't having a curry with it. I'm eating it on its own, so I can tell you. Does it taste all right? Is, is it spicy? I, I don't know. Price-wise, £1.25 at the minute. I don't know if that was on offer. That was in Tesco. Um, so, don't know. Let's see. Is it any good? Oh, done. Steaming hot. Steaming hot. It only takes two minutes now. I'll focus in and I'll show you a close-up of what it actually looks like. There you go. It's, uh, I don't know, it doesn't look too bad. It's a bit more darker than it's appearing on the, the camera because of the lighting and that. It's more of a, a, a darker yellow colour, but not bright yellow. It's like the pilau rice. And you can see all of the spinach which was on the top of the packet i had to give it a good mix before i put it out and then there's little bits of potato i don't know if you can see that in there which just fell off the fork smell wise it smells similar to um i don't know if you've ever bought them they were a pound i don't know what they are now in b&m and own bargains and that little um little packets boxes of microwave indian meals there's a couple of videos on the channel look back for them and you'll see, see which ones I'm talking about. But this, they, they all seem to smell similar. I don't know. Uh, right, it should be cool enough to try. So let's see. Um, Rice-wise, yeah, I can squeeze it, but it's not like home cut when you squeeze it. It just breaks apart. And this is a bit, I think it might be a bit rubbery. I don't know. Uh, let's get in and see. It's not too bad, actually, the consistency. Let's get this bit with spinach and potato on the whole shebang in one. In my gob. Hmm. Hmm. Rating first on that one then. I'm going to give it a, a thumbs up. It's not bad. Not bad. Not a bad price, 125 And I wouldn't mind that with a bit of curry on top. Obviously not a tin. One of the spice and easy packs, of course. Make a curry, and if that's all you've got in the cupboard, you've not got any decent quality basmati rice that you're going to make yourself, then that's perfectly acceptable. I mean, the, the consistency of it is not bad at all. It's not... Do you know what I mean? Rubbery... A lot of these microwave rices, it's chewy, and this is not. And it, it's not a bad texture. Flavour-wise, it's not bursting with spices and flavour, uh, as in the Indian flavour, but it is there. It, it's quite subtle. 
there is, you can see the spinach, you can see the pieces of potato in there. And it's, it's nicely, mildly spiced. Um, but if you're having a curry on it, then you're going to lose, if it's like really well spiced and quite strong, you're going to lose that flavour with your curry anyway that's on top of it. So it's mildly spiced and it's nice. Well worth a dabble, 125, a thumbs up on it. I didn't think I'd give that a thumbs up, but mmm. Two would have come up little chumpy bums, didn't they? Yeah, it's not bad at all, not bad at all. What else can I say? The flavours are coming through. You can taste the spinach, you can taste the potato when you buy it into a piece because it's small cubes of potato. And like I say, texture's nice. It's not stodgy, it's not rubbery, it's not chewy. It's quite good. And Mr's here. Look, 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 look. You remember when Zeus used to do that? He used to appear and his nose used to just appear. Yeah, he just took up the mantle. So yeah, go and buy it. 125 in Tesco. I don't know how much it is in other supermarkets. It's new and it's limited edition, so I don't know how long it's going to be out. I'm going to sort Doggo out. Don't forget we're not live tomorrow. But make sure you've got notifications on because there'll be some shorts videos hopefully throughout the week. We're going to go and uh, get the canoe out because it's, it's going to be raining all week, I think. But <laughs> I don't know. Uh, at least it gives him time to learn how to swim, doesn't it? And I'll catch you later. Ta-ta!